Hi, it's Scott from the Cedar Workshop, and today we're doing a follow-up video to the uh, homemade cooler that's built in at the back of our garage. Okay, now we're in the flower fridge. There's the ceiling. I insulated with some pink insulation and a light. And over in the corner, there is the uh, air conditioner. So now we got some flowers here. These are all centerpieces that would go on the wedding tables. A little bit over 10 Celsius and around 52 Fahrenheit. The only concern is the air conditioner we have is, is this a little one? really should have about a 10,000 BTU and I think this one's probably around 5,000 or maybe even less. Might have to take that out and put a different one in and a lot of condensation coming down the wall too. We have a window here. This is the uh, low rent bubble wrap over the window to help with the heat loss until I get something better. Put some, uh, I think this is R5 extra insulation, pink closed cell insulation along the wall here and on the ceiling. Now since this one is on wheels, there's always concern that it could get bumped. So we put this safety strap I got a four inch screw into a stud here. I just got a rubber strap around it and that'll keep it from rolling out. You never know. So we end up going with this uh, portable Danby 12,000 BTU air conditioner. One of the reasons was uh, we could use a remote control on it. It was a little bit easier to get to. Just pretty slick. So there you go. The reason why it's up so high is the theory is the cold air will come, cold air will come out here, flow down to the flowers. The straps here are just to hold it on on the back. We ended up putting the uh, water catch because we notice uh, when it's running, it creates a lot of condensation. So we put the uh, the two tanks on the back. So it's moved out from the wall a good six or eight inches. So it just sits on the edge of this platform. What we're planning to do is we're going to take this and lower it down and have this part here about maybe about this part. Um, my wife just says it just doesn't get cold enough. So that's the next step. Okay, now we're gonna go into our garage that's been converted into a forest shack. And there's more on the ground there. Some nice, beautiful red roses. And then let's go into the walk-in cooler. Okay. And we just have some greens that are up on the shelves. So there's the Danby 12,000 BTU portable air conditioner. We moved it down, it used to be up higher. So it's a little bit closer to the ground there. Hopefully that helps with some cooling. I had to come up with some different strap system on the back or the intake because the old intake wouldn't reach and it broke in a couple of places as you can see there so i got the old tuck tape blowing it up okay the thermostat is set to 16 degrees celsius i don't know what that's in fahrenheit if you see below i'll show you in the credits so on the back of the door my wife has attached a thermometer it gives you what the room temperature is at and the goal is 10 degrees Celsius 
or 50 degrees Fahrenheit and looks like we're just, just, just a tad above that but this is good news I think moving the air conditioner down to a lower level was the way to get it cooler in here so anyway so I'll hopefully have one more video after this but thanks for watching